Hey guys, my name is Ryan Balderson, VP of Sales for Seafox Boat Company, and I'm on our 328 Commander. We just came in from offshore. It is blowing out there. It's rough. It's blowing southwest 15 to 20, the wind is, and it was rough conditions. But before I take you on board and do an in-depth walkthrough and showing you all the new features on this boat, I wanted to show you how high our freeboard is on our 328 Commander. So it really keeps you dry out there. We got a big Carolina flare in the bow. We got a high freeboard. Um, so, you know, it comes up to my thighs, so you feel really safe. And the new feature, we just came out with this detubing glass enclosure. I want to show you that. So I want to bring you on board, do an in-depth walkthrough, and show you everything on this boat. So now we're on the 328 Commander. I'm up in the bow area. Before I get started showing you an in-depth walkthrough, I just want to kind of give you a background of this boat. This boat is designed for the family and the fishermen. I mean, this boat's got 12 rod holders up and down the gunnels. It's got cushions everywhere, loungers, and just tons and tons of amenities. Premium sound system with JL Audio. And so I just want to tell you, so when we design these boats, we design it for everyone. The fishermen, the family, the mom, the kids. You can do water sports, go to the sandbar, and you can go to the Gulf Stream. You can do everything in this boat. It's got a 10-8 beam. It's super wide, stable from bottom fishing to trolling. Uh, you can see we designed a big Carolina flare up here. I mean, I've had 17 people on this boat. It's yacht certified. As long as you have the life jackets, you can put that many people on this boat. It's safe. So we're up in the bow of the 328. You can see the big Carolina flare, how wide it is up here. But up here, all the way in the bow is the windless system. It's a through hull anchor system. So the mom, all she has to do is hit a button right here, it deploys the anchor, you're ready for the sandbar, or if you're fishing, you just hit this button, drops it out, hit the button up, brings it right in. It's through the hull, it's nice and clean, out of the way, and you can also see we designed tension hinges right here, so it keeps it nice and safe, so it's not dropping on your hand. So we always try to do little things like that at Sea Fox to make it safe and easy for you to use. Also up in the bow, you can see all the cushions we have, and we even angle them right here, we contour them. So when you're cruising, super comfortable. Ergonomics work, you're not sitting straight up and down. So mom, kids are happy when y'all are cruising. Also, you can see there's storage all under here. So you can keep all your life jackets and everything stored nice, nice and away, easy access. These cushions easily unsnap. And then we built in these backrests. All you do is just flip them out, push this button, flips right in super easy to use. You're not pulling a cushion in and out, storing it down below. All you gotta do is flip it right out and it locks in. And it's comfortable too. You can sit this way or you can sit this way. And you have your handrail, so if it gets rough, you always got safety right here. So I just kind of showed you the bow area on this boat. Now we're moving aft and you can see this oversized lounger. It's really comfortable. It's got a nice angle back here. It's, so when you sit down, Really, the ergonomics are perfect. It's great for your passengers, kids, they can all sit right here. And you can see it's got great visibility. We have the big Carolina flare, so you're not getting sprayed in the face with, you know, if it gets rough. Got great sound system up here, so you can hear the music. It's just a great spot on the boat. So now moving aft towards the console, I was telling you guys earlier, we were offshore. It was super rough out there. Wind was blowing and occasionally you get a spray. And one feature that we just designed on this model is the new detubing with the glass enclosure. And that came in handy out there. So if you got the occasional spray over the, over the side of the boat, this glass will keep you nice and dry when you're piloting. And you can see, I mean, this thing is stout. It is built to last. And it does not move when you're out there in the ocean. And you also have the vent. So if you have a nice breezy day like this, you can just open it up, get some airflow through. So when you're trolling, it's not hot behind this glass enclosure. You can just flip that up and get a nice breeze in. Keeps you nice and cool. And one feature I really want to show you guys is the triple helm seats. We are the only 32 footer on the market that has triple helm seats. Everyone else has double helm seats. And it allows the captain to pilot from the center of the boat and you get your Garmin's, they're angled right at you. These are 8616s, the best you can buy from Garmin. They're awesome, easy to use, touch screen. And you got your controls right here. This is tilt, you got your key switch, kill switch for safety, switch panel, and your Yamaha CL5 gauge. 
So this 328 Commander is one of our demos. It's loaded out. It's got every option we basically offer. It's got the LED tech package with wireless remote uh, charging system for your cell phone. It's got the pro package with the extra rod holders and the gunnels with the gas shocks. It's got underwater LED lights. It's got blue ambient lighting at night, which is really cool all through the cockpit. So this boat is loaded. And also it's got the, an air conditioner down below. So what I mentioned earlier, this boat's 10-8 beam. So with the wide beam, we're able to make a big console drive from the center of the boat, triple helm seats, and you have a berth down below and an air conditioner, which is an option. So if you're down in Florida or it's here in South Carolina where it gets hot in the summer, the AC option is nice. So you can go down, stretch out, or if the weather gets bad, you can go down below, run the AC and stay cool down there. It also has a head with an optional overboard discharge. So ladies like that, kids like that, and also a sink, wash your hands. It's got everything down there. It's a nice big open space down underneath this console. So I was talking about the new detubing glass enclosure, which is brand new for this model, but also is this new hardtop. It's got tons of storage. You got storage here. They're on tension hinges like I showed you earlier, so it doesn't slam. You got storage here. You got lighting, 360 degree of lighting. You got ambient lighting here. And you got a cool Coast Guard safety uh, storage box right up here. It holds two fire extinguishers, flares, whistles uh, for the Coast Guard. Just flip it right down if you ever get boarded. It's easy access and great storage. So with this oversized hardtop, there's a built-in sunroof on this boat. It's tinted, so you don't have to worry about UV rays coming in to burn you. But if you do want to get tanned, like me, you can just open it up and you'll get plenty of sunshine and you can get wind. So it's a great feature on this boat. So moving aft on the 328 Commander, now we're in the cockpit. This is where the fishability happens. We got a built-in tackle center right here. It's got a cutting board, you got a sink. And actually under here, you can store ballyhoo uh, if you're fishing offshore. You got your freshwater wash down, plenty of spots to put your drinks for beverages. You can pull them right out of your premium cooler right here. We got tackle storage right here as well in the seating pod. And then you can see all the rod holders we built into this boat. So it really makes it nice for fishing. You can store your rods, get them out of the way for the run out. Or, you know, you're going to the restaurant, you don't have them all over your gunnels, you can just put them right up, up top. So it's a really, really nice big cockpit with a 10-8 with a beam. So a lot of fishability back here. So we've been working our way through the 328 Commander. Now we're at the stern. And you can see that we have two huge oversized live wells and they're pressurized. And we spent a lot of time designing these so it keeps your baits nice and fresh throughout the day. We caught these menhaden in these live wells at 7 a.m. this morning, ran offshore, it was rough. It, wind was blowing, big seas, and these baits are still pristine. And the reason because of that, because it goes all water, no air. So these baits are perfectly suspended in these live wells. And we built an aquarium style so it gets plenty of sunlight in there so that so you can keep an eye on your baits as well make sure they're staying nice and fresh throughout the day and this boat is powered with Yamaha 300s it pushes this boat over 50 miles an hour it gives it great fuel economy and no problem getting on plane plenty of power for this package another nice feature on this boat is the side door earlier today we were catching fish we caught a couple of amberjacks we didn't want to kill those fish so we just tailed them right through this door you can lay them right on the deck, pull the hook out, and then slide them right out the door and release them safely. Or if you have an undersized cobia or you didn't, you're not sure about the size of the cobia, you can pull it right in, measure it, and, uh, and not kill the fish. So it's a really nice feature. It's great for diving. So you can just step right off the boat, easy access into the water. And we have an optional ladder that goes right here. So if you're at the sandbar, you can clip the ladder in get in and out of the boat so you're staying away from the motors. So it's a really great feature on this boat. So one of the most comfortable spots on the boat when it's rough is in the stern. And we built in a nice oversized flip out stern seat. So we got done fishing today. My son Porter, he flipped it out, had a great ride in right here. And his buddy flipped this up, rode in right there. It's a great, great ride. Uh, protects you from the elements. You got this big console right here so you can sit all that long ride home. So on this boat, it's got great under deck storage. Midship, you got two boxes 
that store two fish, fishing rods on each side so you can store them, get them out of the way. As you work your way aft, you got two huge oversized fish boxes that are macerated so it's easy to clean. Then you have at your dive door, side door, you have a, a separate box here that's insulated. You can put drinks so you can swim up at the sandbar, access that. And then right here in the center, you have a mechanical box that has your fuel water separators, pumps, all your access to, to any maintenance items you may need. So it's a great, great feature on this boat. So we just finished up going through the features on the 328 Commander. I hope you enjoyed it. And you can actually build the boat on our website, seafoxboats.com. You can pick all the options you saw on this boat from the gray powder coat to the motors and get actually a price, uh, our Foxy deal. And you can also find a, your nearest Seafox dealer through our website as well. So seafoxboats.com, hope you enjoyed it, 328 Commander.